Hi guys and welcome back to what should hopefully be the last part of the tutorial here on HTML5 video. So we're just going to do, be doing a little bit of testing now just on the content that we've made. Now in the last video we did look at uh, Internet Explorer and how uh, we've got this working in an older version. This is the Flash plugin. So as you can see the video is playing. Uh, we can skip to different parts of it. Um, the skin that we made is now linked up correctly and it works, so that's great. This is it in Chrome. Uh, we've got the JavaScript here, so big, small, normal, that all works. This is the HTML play, so it's not loading the plugin. It's just loading the HTML and nothing else. Again, we can play that, skip across. Uh, this is the volume controls. You can make it full screen, whatever. So we've got it working in Chrome. Uh, Opera. Uh, this is already loaded in here. In fact, I'm just going to take this uh, file URL. Uh, again, we can make it big, small, normal, works in Opera. Um, we can play it, skip across uh, parts of it. Sorry, that was a bit loud. <laughs> uh, the volume controls and everything, that's all there. Uh, in IE, so this will be an interesting one, uh, if I just paste that in here. Um, this is no ActiveX control warning, so if you just allow block content here, uh, we've got the player here, which is obviously hidden when your mouse rolls over it. Like I say, the browsers use different uh, players and things like that. Uh, they use their own. Obviously, Microsoft uses their own. But again, it does play, and you can skip and change everything. And even this works, the JavaScript works in it in IE, which is great. Uh, Firefox. Uh, I don't believe there'll be a problem with that. Nope. As you can see, Firefox uses a different player as well, but it's all the same. The JavaScript works. That's wonderful. Uh, if I play that, exact same result. So it's all good. Volume controls there. You can, again, maximize it if you want to. And Safari. Now, Safari has a problem. You shouldn't notice it on my uh, screen once it loads, but basically Safari has an issue with it, which in order to um, in order to play the video on Windows in Safari, you need QuickTime. It's finally loaded. So this works for me, but if it doesn't work for you in Safari, the reason for it is that if you're using Windows and possibly Linux, I don't know about that, you will need to install QuickTime. I don't think this is the same for Mac users, but Mac users will probably already have QuickTime anyway. But again, it does work. The, uh, the uh, JavaScript works, and of course, we've got this uh, play thing here. So that might be an error you encounter. And the way that you fix and text, uh, test that is if you just simply download and install QuickTime, it might require a restart. But other than that, as you can see, uh, we have got it working and we can uh, skip through it and everything.